how to change keyboard language in Mac. If you're using MacBook Air, MacBook Pro or iMac, the process is going to be same. Now, in order to change keyboard language, you need to add languages to your keyboard first. Now, how can you do that? For that, you can go in system settings or else you can go and select Apple logo at the top and then select system settings. Now, once you open system settings page, go down and look for keyboard option. Select that particular option and on the right hand side, you will get all the options related to your keyboard. Now in text input, you will find input sources option and in front of that, it will show you which keyboard you are using right now. So to add languages to your keyboard, you need to select this edit option. Now once you select edit, you will get a pop up screen like this and currently you can see I have only one keyboard language added in my Mac. In order to add multiple languages or other languages, you can go and select plus option on this window. And after that, again, you will get a pop up screen and it will showcase all the languages which are available to use. So you can find Japanese over here. You can find Italian, Irish, and there are much more other options. Now, let's say uh, if you're using Japanese over here. So if I select Japanese on the right hand side, it will show me the two keyboard formats which are available for Japanese. So if I select the Japanese uh, first option, it is going to display the keyboard like this. If I select the second option, it is going to display the keyboard like this. So you can select your preferred keyboard. So for now, I'm going to select this keyboard and to add this language, I'm going to select add option. Now you can see I have added another language to my keyboard. So if you select this language again, it will show you multiple options. You can choose whichever font size you want. You can check out all these basic details. Now, you, if you don't make any changes over here on this panel, it's okay. You can directly start using this keyboard. If you want to add more keyboard, you can again select this plus option, select another language which you want, and then you can select whichever keyboard type you want. So let's say if I want Irish, I'm going to select this Irish and I'm going to select this, uh, you know, keyboard type, select add, and it will add another language so let's add few more languages over here so now i have selected korean again there are multiple keyboard types select any particular uh, option which you want and then select add option and then it will be added over here now just simply select done option one more thing again go on edit option and this time make sure show input menu is on so because if it is off you won't find uh, you know any option on the menu bar to change the language directly Although you can use another option to change language easily with a shortcut, but if you, uh, you know, turn on this toggle, which says uh, show input menu in menu bar, you will get this keyboard language shortcut over here. So if I select that, it will showcase which keyboard language is selected for now. And it will also showcase all the options or all the languages which we have added. Again, one more thing, if you don't want to enable this toggle, all you need to do is under this press globe key option, you can select this drop down, and over here, you can select change input source. So what will happen is if you press this globe icon on your keyboard, if I press it for now, it will showcase the keyboard language which is selected. So you can press it multiple times to select any one particular language. So if I stop on Japanese currently, we have selected Japanese keyboard and same will be displayed over here. If you have turned on the input menu option in the menu bar. Now let's go in notepad. Now, as I have selected Japanese for now, if I start typing over here, you can see it is displaying everything in Japanese. So if I want to change the keyboard language, if I press globe icon, you can see I can change the keyboard language from here as well, or else I can directly go here. If I select Korean over here, and if I start typing, you can see it is typing in Korean. If I go and select Irish over here, Irish is nothing but English only. So as you can see, I can simply change the keyboard language with a click of a button or over here, you can select the shortcut option. So yeah, that's how easy it is to change keyboard language in your Mac. So I hope this video was helpful. If it was, then don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I will see you all in the next one. Thank you.